Welcome back, ladies. Um, somebody in the comments asked me to make a basketball game. <laughs> um, in my slowest YouTube growing channel ever. Um, but I think you can do anything if you know the basics. So, um, I hate long videos. So, I'm going to try and make something from scratch in five minute bites. So, a basketball game from scratch, okay? So, I'm not a jock. I don't, I don't know anything about basketball. The only thing I know is we've got an orange ball, right? And you've got a bunch of people in your way trying to, like, take the ball from you or get in the way. Um, if you want to know about, like, raspberry pies or any other nerdy subject, I'm your guy. So, all right, first thing I just made, this is going to be the ball, I guess. Um, the physics of the ball, basically, right? So you have this guy here. I just created a mesh, new object, ball. You hit play, and nothing happens. It floats, all right? Okay, I'm doing the very, very basics, like things I forgot as a, you know, just now. Um, so you've got your ball. It's not going to fall until you add a rigid body. So rigid spelling. All right. So now it's going to fall. Got the rigid body. Big surprise. It's going to fall. Yay! Okay, so there's the ball. Let's uh, really quickly make it orange. Um, is this boring you already? <laughs> so I'm going to make a materials folder. Whoops. Right click. Create folder. Call it materials. In the materials, right click. Create material. Orange. Select that material. Go over into Inspector. Click Albedo. And go ahead and select Orange. There it is. I don't even know if it's like brownish orange, the basketball. Or is it like reddish orange? I don't know. Leave a comment. No, don't leave a comment. I don't care what color basketball is. So I think it's like that, maybe. Okay. Um, that's our basketball. I'm going to drag the material onto the basketball. And guess what? It just sticks to the ground. Next lesson. Um, let's add some physics to the material. I'll just do it right here. Um, add create physics material. All right. So let's call this bounce. And up here, um, the bounciness is zero. I assume one is super bouncy. Let's go ahead and drag that onto. I don't think you could drag it right to the ball, but let's check. Ooh, I think you can. Let's go to inspector of the ball. Um, yes, it took it. All right. So don't add bounciness to the earth. Who knows what will happen. Yay! Okay. That's kind of like a basketball. Even though it's underinflated. Next time I'm going to go and do AI and people in your face. And the third episode will be physics. Of shooting the ball. Alright. See ya. Bye.